Why don't we put that down? One of the interesting elements of shooting the series has been that it's a very varied approach to a script. So it's it's a really nice uh, mix of, of the personal and the very dynamic. So we go from being something that focuses on uh, one camera with one character into something there's multiple cameras, cameras uh, on quad bikes, cameras on uh, boats. Uh, we've used all sorts of uh, different techniques, ways of getting as many shots as possible to cut together these very dynamic action sequences. We've had some great explosions in the season as well. And then we've been lucky enough to have uh, a drone with us for the duration of the production. But it wasn't just about the idea of using the drone as a flying element to be high and, and wide, but to also try and bring it in and make it a little bit more personal and give us the sense that, that the camera although high would often uh, drop down into the actor's space as the scenes were beginning in particular. It also gives us this flexibility to get out over the water, which is uh, also something that's very, very difficult to do in any traditional sense. I think of the top five hardest films ever made, I think at least two of them have been shot on the water, that being Jaws and Waterworld, and they all cite working on water being an utter nightmare. I think at least on Waterworld they had the, the, the sense to shoot that in the Caribbean or somewhere like that. But um, to shoot boats in the west coast of Scotland in winter, I, I hope is one of the toughest things that we'll ever do on camera um, because just the, the nature of the sea and how she works. And I remember seeing at one point we had five boats on the water and I was looking at the boats and they were all going in separate directions. Yeah, and that kind of sums it up, really. <laughs> Nicola Walker's learnt how to drive a powerboat. Jamie has learnt how to drive a powerboat as well. I think Hugh is going to do his um, his licence. And that's that's really fun to see the actors enjoying that very much. Round and round off. You have to learn to drive things when you're an actor. You have to jump in and out of cars and stuff. But I've never uh, driven a boat. I have never, um, so a complete novice. It's all very well when you're sitting at home reading that you jump into the rib and fly up the Clyde. <laughs> then of course you got to learn how to jump in the, in the rib and how not only to drive the rib, but how to drive bigger boats. So I'm now the proud owner of a level two powerboat license. So which is recognized all over the world. So I can go anywhere in the world whatsoever and say, I'm commandeering that boat, thanks. You know, it's like you've got to fake it to look as, as, as though you've been doing it forever. And when you're, you know, a beginning, you tend to be very careful. And I was really, I was really nervous about it. It just sometimes I think you can see the terror <laughs> around my mouth. I'm trying very hard to cover it. It's either terror or just like, um, just absolute joy. It sort of veers between the two. Piloting a rib at 30 knots down the Clyde has been just great fun. I mean, who gets to do that? It's wonderful, can't get enough. So just do more stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to be seeing more stuff in scripts about me. Maybe even, maybe like that Bond chase along the Thames, something like that. When we do the scenes of Annika arriving into harbour or pulling up to a pontoon, I am, I, I'm sm like I'm smiling and acting, but inside the internal monologue, it's just me swearing in terror. Because when you're, try when you're trying to act and you're trying to neatly, essentially park a very expensive boat, um, it's quite, it's, it's, it's really frightening. It's really frightening. If you make a mistake, it's, gonna, it's going to be expensive. And they talk to you like you're the captain. I mean, that's the rule, you know, I am, the, it's my boat, I am the captain of the boat. <laughs> and I think they've got a lot of faith in me, probably more than I have in my, my skills. We have had a great boat team and we've had very willing actors and that's really fun to see the actors enjoying that very much. And our crew are, you know, they're really good at dealing with the challenges of, of taking on the water. Oh, it's been, it's been a fantastic show to, to make and we are really, really proud of everything that we've achieved here.